up and welcome back to vitamin p it's another episode thanks for tuning in and today i thought i would do a video because it is after all flu season and i'm sure you're seeing all those commercials it's time to get your flu shots and should you get the flu shot or do you get the flu shot or did you already get the flu shot well um this is vitamin P's opinion and this is my disclaimer. Hey, if your doctor says to do it and you feel you should do it, go ahead and do it. I don't want anybody to think that flu season is only now, all right, which is November to uh, March, which is when they, you know, the time that they uh, consider to be flu season. You can catch the flu at any time of the year. Okay, it's just that it's more alive during this time from November till March. So they push uh, the flu shot. And uh, a lot of people get them, a lot of people don't. There's a lot of controversy on it. A lot of doctors say yes. A lot of uh, other people and doctors say no. And you know, we all understand that vaccines can be very useful, okay? I mean, for example, uh, chicken pox, right? When I was a kid, there wasn't any vaccine for chicken pox. If someone got chicken pox, uh, parents would want their kids to go to that person's house and they would have a chicken pox party because chicken pox, if you don't get it when you're young, it turns into uh, shingles when you're older as an adult, right? And I don't even think kids get chicken pox anymore because they have a vaccine for it. So they put the chicken pox in the kids and they end up not getting it. And is it the same with the flu shot? I mean, that is the idea, right? To insert the flu inside your body so that you're immune to it and so that your body can fight it off. And we have to remember what this is. This is a virus that they are putting in your body and they hope that they found the right strain because remember what scientists do is they collect a whole bunch of strains of the flu throughout the world throughout the year and then around this time of the year they kind of mix them together and inject them in your body hoping that the strain of flu that you will get uh, this will help to avoid the flu in your body that's the whole point of why they put it in your body to fight it when it comes in your body and do you need the flu shot uh, the answer from vitamin P online is no you do not need the flu shot I know there's a lot of, there's two sides, one side saying yes, there's nothing wrong with getting it, so just get it, and then the other side saying no, you're putting the poison in your body, you don't need to do that. Just keep your immune system strong by eating healthy options, and that should help avoid you getting sick. Me personally, I've not been sick in over five years, I mean, that was the last time I was sick. And I remember it very clearly. I was really, really ill. But since then, my diet had Im has improved. And don't get me wrong, sometimes I'll get a little uh, sniffles. Uh, but that's pretty much it. And the sniffles is a little, it is technically a, a bacteria that has gotten into my body. And my body's forcing it out with mucus. And I, you got to blow it out of your nose or you got to spit it out, right? So uh, the flu is no different than any other cold. It's just a more serious one. And a lot of people do get them, but if you take care of yourself, you eat the right foods, um, you will uh, help to avoid this from happening to you. So, if you want to get the flu shot, do what you want to do. If you want to get one, that's fine. Does vitamin P recommend it? No. Your doctor might. But then, of course, you'll find other opinions online such as myself saying maybe not something that you need who needs a flu shot I would say if you're a senior citizen uh, maybe it might help to boost your immune system because once you get old your immune system uh, starts to break down unless you're just taking care of yourself period so anyways that's another video from vitamin P on the flu shot hope you enjoyed this one Make sure to take care of yourself. Make sure to eat your fruits and veggies and to build up a strong immune system so you do not get cold, uh, catch a, a bacteria virus this season. Peace.